There's an internet truism that goes around that is D&D is a combat simulator. And for a long time, this statement has annoyed me. I find that I really enjoy engaging in debate and discussion and arguments and things like that. I, I really enjoy, you know, picking a point and defending that point with other people. But I often find I lack the understanding or the words to get a point, to get, get across what I'm trying to say. Um, but I think I have finally come to understand what actually annoys me about this statement. D&D is a combat simulator. And I think what it... What it boils down to is that the statement is saying one thing while implying another. The thing that D&D is a combat simulator implies, at least in my opinion, is that D&D is not a role-playing game. D&D is a combat simulator seems to contain within it the idea that D&D is not a role-playing game. Now, not everybody who says D&D is a combat simulator probably means that D&D is not a role-playing game. But I do think that many people who say D&D is a combat simulator do believe that. I do believe that they think that for one reason or another that D&D is not a legitimate entry into the role-playing franchise. And I think that when you're having that discussion, and I think that's a discussion that can be had, is D&D a role-playing game? I think that that is an honest discussion. I think that that is a real debate that you can actually engage in. But the problem with D&D is a combat simulator is it's, it's really not something that you can debate. D&D obviously has combat simulation in it. And if having combat simulation in it is enough to make it a combat simulator, then does that make Lancer a combat simulator as well? Does that make Blades in the Dark a combat simulator? It has a way to resolve combat between two parties powered by the apocalypse. Is that a combat simulator? If only having a combat simulation aspect to it is enough to make it a combat simulator, how much combat simulation can be in a tabletop role-playing game before it is just a combat simulator? But that's not what actually people are trying to say about D&D, right? They are trying to say that D&D is not a system suited for or designed for role-play. But when they say that, they encounter a greater deal of pushback, a greater deal of argumentation, and there's a lot, e a lot of easy points people can make in refutation of that. But when you say combat, D&D is a combat simulator, then there's some very simple truisms you can fall back on. Look how many pages in the rule books are dedicated to combat versus other things. Look how many character abilities, look how many character classes are dedicated to combat. And these things conveniently ignore things like races and backgrounds and class features which have nothing to do with combat, like bardic inspiration, which can be used for roleplay situations. It ignores the fact that many spells, while they are originally combat engineered, might be useful outside of combat for various roleplay applications. And again, getting down that rabbit hole is just getting into the weeds and giving the people who made the statement exactly what they want. A discussion on their terms about what D&D is or is not. But what they're trying to avoid saying is D&D is not a role-playing game which is, in my opinion, a patently absurd and false statement. And when I think about it from that perspective, suddenly this discussion doesn't annoy me nearly as much because now we are actually having a real conversation directly instead of talking around each other or in circles of each other or alluding to something deeper. D&D is a combat simulator is an effort to delegitimize D&D in some way, to almost ascribe a moral component to mechanics, to create a situation where uh, you are more ethical, more moral in your role playing because you play games that are designed around systems other than combat. Therefore, these games are superior on their face. When you deny that D&D &D is a role-playing game and you put it in the box of being a pure combat simulator, then you have denied it all of the wonderful and beautiful things that are obviously true about playing D&D. &D. You have denied the simple reality that when people sit down to play D&D, &D, 
They often do so with a healthy dose of role play. You have taken that away from them. You have said, sure, you may do that there, but that is wrong. That is not what D&D is for. I have determined that D&D is for combat. D&D is not a role playing game. And I think that that is a argument that at the very least would be a lot less obnoxious to have than the one around D&D being a combat simulator.